Hello and welcome back to the Excelgy videos. Today we will explain the formula syntax and usage of the day function in Excel. Microsoft Excel day function returns an integer representing the day of the month from 1 to 31 of a date supplied in the argument. Day function takes only single argument that is serial number. Serial number is the date from which you want to extract the day component and it must be in valid Excel format. The dates can be supplied either as serial number, reference to the cell location that contains dates or date value returned from another function. In case if date is supplied directly into the argument, chances are high that Excel will misinterpret date and return a different result due to different date settings on computer. All right, let's have a look at some day function examples and explore how to use day function in Microsoft Excel. As we can see, there are few dummy date entries in different formats given in column A and we have to extract the day from them in column B. In the first example, we will extract the date from a cell that contains only date value. So we go to B9 and enter day function and hit tab to auto complete the function. We take A9 as cell reference and hit enter. As soon as we hit enter, we get 23 as day returned by function in cell B9. Now if you look at A10, it stores date and timestamp together. So when we take this into argument and hit control enter, function extracted only day component from it and returned in cell B10. And same happened when dates are stored in different or customized format, function only extracts and returns the day of the date in cell successfully. Since we know that Excel stores dates or time as number representing the date since January 1st, 1900, number 1 is treated as January 1st, 1900, 2 is treated as January 2nd, 1900 and 42,155 is treated as May 31st, 2015. So when we take this into argument and hit enter, function returns 31 as the day of the date in cell B12. In the fifth example, A13 has a date which has returned by date function and we will extract the day from the date which is returned by formula. Anyway, we enter function in cell B13 and take A13 and as soon as we hit enter, function successfully returns the day of the date. That's because function returned the valid Excel date in serial number format in A13, hence day function returned 25 as the answer in B13. Similarly, you can return the current day by nesting today function inside day function and get the current day in the cell. In the last and seventh example, we will see what happens when we directly supply date in the arguments in double quotes. So, Again, the function extracts and returns day from it successfully. However, when you remove double quotes or supply dates without double quotes, function returns zero as the answer. That's because the date supplied in the argument is not in valid Excel format. Hence, function returns zero as the answer. Well, this is how you can use day function to extract day component from different kinds of date format. If you like this video, don't forget to click on the subscribe button to get regular updates and feel free to share this video tutorial with your friends as well. That's all for now. We hope you found this lesson informative. Stay tuned and keep learning with us. Thank you and have a nice day.